pH skill and importance of pH skill in daily life. In this lecture, I will teach you the complete concept of pH skill. First of all, let me teach you that what is a pH skill? Well, the pH skill is a tool that measures how acidic or basic a substance is. Or we say that pH stands for power of hydrogen or potential of hydrogen. The pH skill ranges from 2 to 14. pH 7 means a substance is neutral. If a substance has a pH lower than 7, it is called acidic. On the other hand, if the pH is higher than 7, it is called basic. For example, consider lemon juice. It is acidic because its pH ranges from 2 to 3. In contrast, a common soup is basic because its pH ranges from 9 to 10. Remember that the pH of pure water is 7. It means that pure water is neither acidic nor basic. I always say that water is a she-male because it is neither male nor female. Here, remember this important MCQs. The pH of rainwater ranges from 5.0 and 5.5. It is because certain gases like carbon dioxide gas absorb in rainwater. Hence, rainwater is acidic. Just remember that pH skill is a tool that measures how acidic or basic a substance is. Now we will learn the easy concept of litmus paper. Remember that litmus paper is indicator which tells us either a substance is acidic or basic. There are two types of litmus paper. Red litmus paper and blue litmus paper. Here, note it down this easy trick. We know that acids are dangerous. So it turns litmus paper red. It is because Red is a dangerous sign. On the other hand, bases are not that much dangerous. So it turns litmus paper blue. For example, consider this lemon juice and soupy water. When you dip blue litmus paper into lemon juice, it will turn red. It shows that lemon juice is an acid because it turns blue litmus paper red. Secondly, when you dip red litmus paper into soupy water, it will turn blue. It shows that soupy water is a base because it turns red litmus paper blue. Remember that if litmus paper doesn't change color to red or blue, it means that a substance is a neutral. For instance, Pure water doesn't change the color of either litmus paper because it is a neutral having pH 7. Thus remember that litmus paper is an indicator that shows whether a substance is an acid, base or neutral. Now we will learn the importance of pH in everyday life. We say that plants and animals are pH sensitive. For example, plants like blueberries prefer acidic soil which has pH around 6.0 to 4.5, while garbage grows better in neutral soil which has pH around 6.0 to 7.5. On the other hand, our stomach has strong acid which we call hydrochloric acid. The pH of hydrochloric acid is 1.5 to 3.5. This acidic pH of stomach helps us to break down the food. If stomach acid becomes too high, it can cause heartburn. To balance, we take tablets that are alkaline substances which neutralizes excess acid in our stomach. Similarly, Human skin has slightly acidic pH around 5.5 to protect against bacteria. If we use harsh soup which disturbs the pH of our skin, then it will cause dryness in our skin. 
Secondly, acid rain. When the pH of rain water goes below 5.6, this rain is known as acid rain. Acid rain then flow into the rivers and lakes to lower the pH of water. As a result of this, aquatic life like fish die due to change in pH of water. Also, acid rain damage buildings and historical places. For example, Taj Mahal has been affected by acid rain. Thus, these examples show that maintaining the right pH level is essential for the health and survival of living organism. Even small changes can have big effect. Hence, noted down these important examples.